Hey, this is Steve with Data Lab. In this quick video, I'm going to walk through how you can set up the default region that your Lambda function is deployed to when you're using the Alexa Skills Kit CLI. This is a question that's come up a few times in the comments, so I thought I would just create a video to walk through the process. All this stuff changes pretty quickly, so check the video description to see if there's a link to an updated tutorial. And if there is, click that link and watch the updated tutorial, not this one. Okay, with that, let's jump into it. When the Alexa Skills Kit CLI installs, it also installs, unless it's already installed, the uh, AWS SDK, or at least I think it does, because the AWS SDK uses a hidden folder with a, a, a config file in it to set defaults that are used when um, the Lambda functions are deployed. And so if you're on a Mac, you can get to that. The, the hidden folder is uh, named .aws, and it is um, in your home directory on a Mac or Linux. So if you just uh, change into tilde or squiggly, uh, that'll take you by default to your home directory. And then if they're uh, in there, if you list the directories or the folders that are in there, you'll, you won't see it because it, is, it starts with uh, .aws. But if you do cd.aws, you'll see that there is actually a folder there. And I believe it's installed in the same place on Windows. I believe it's installed in your home directory or it's created the, the folder in your home directory, but you wouldn't see it in Windows Explorer. You'd have to do it from the um, Windows command prompt and uh, CD into it, or I think, not 100% sure. Maybe somebody can comment on that just to uh, let anybody else know if I'm right or wrong there. Uh, but once you're in here, if you go ls, you'll see a file config. This is the file that we want to edit. So if you open that up in your code editor, I'm using, using Visual Studio Code, which is why I'm using code there. And that'll open it up in Visual Studio Code. For me, you can open it up in whatever editor you use. And this is what we want here. See this region equals, and then you specify the region that is the default region where you want your Lambda functions to deploy. It is really that easy. And in my case, I've got a, a couple of different profiles set up here. In addition to the default profile, you might just have the default profile. And I can't remember if I added these in or if they were in there by default. But um, if you don't see region equals, just add region equals. And then the um, reference to the reason, region that you want your functions to deploy to. That's it. Hopefully, this was helpful. If you have any questions, you can leave those and I'll respond just as quickly as I can. And if you did find this helpful, you might be interested in the other Alexa development tutorials on the Dabble Lab channel. If you go to youtube.com slash Dabble Lab, you'll find over 110 other Alexa development tutorials that you can check out. Thanks so much.